Don't let the blue screen of death get you down. I will show you how to fix this problem step by step. So let's begin. Click on advanced options. Select troubleshoot. Then click on advanced options. Now select command prompt. Now execute this command carefully. Type chkdsk slash f slash r c colon and hit enter to execute this command type c colon and hit enter to execute the command then type cd space c colon slash and hit enter now type cd space windows and hit enter to execute the command now type cd system32 and hit enter type in cd space config and simply hit enter to execute the command now type md backup and simply hit enter now execute this command type copy space star dot star space backup and simply hit enter now execute the command md space back backup one and simply hit enter now type copy space star dot star space backup one and hit enter now type cd reg back and hit enter now type dir and then simply hit enter to execute the command now type copy space star dot star space dot dot and hit enter then type all and hit enter to execute the command now execute this command type bootrec space slash fix mbr and simply hit enter now type in bootrec space slash fix boot and simply hit enter to execute the command now type in cd space c colon slash and simply hit enter to execute the command now execute this command type cd space windows slash system32 slash config slash regback then simply hit enter to execute this command now type this command bcd edit space slash exports space c colon slash bcd backup then hit enter now type cd space c colon slash and hit enter now type this md space boot and hit enter now execute this command type cd space boot and simply hit enter now type md space bcd and simply hit enter now execute this command type cd space c colon slash and hit enter type attrib c colon slash boot slash bcd dash h dash r dash s and hit enter type in ren c colon backslash boot backslash bcd bcd dot old and simply hit enter to execute this command type bootrec space slash rebuild bcd and hit enter now type exit and simply hit enter now click on continue it will restart your system so that's it guys your problem is solved and you are good to go